Hi, I'm Danny here and another science video for you. What I want to share today is a quick science tip for teaching classification. All you need are IKEA finger puppets. So you can buy these from IKEA. Uh, other finger puppet shops are available. So I'm sure you can find these on Amazon and, and other stores, but you can buy bags of little finger puppet animals. Um, reasonably inexpensive, they don't cost too much money at all. Um, but the beauty of these is that you can use these for teaching classification. So once you've got the animals, uh, you can ask the children to get themselves into pairs. Each child can have an animal and they can ask some questions that can distinguish one animal from the other animal. So does it have wings? Yes, no. Does it have uh, legs? Yes, no. Does it live in the sea? Yes or no. They can find uh, one question maybe that can separate their two animals. Uh, then they could get from a pair into a four and they can find some questions that separate um, the four animals. So it might be two or three questions that can separate these out. Once we get the idea of asking the questions, we can put these on the large sheet of paper and we can do a branching key. They can ask a question and we can draw the yes, no arrows, ask another question, yes, no arrows. And eventually you can have a classification system where each of the animals is at the end of the, um, the classification tree. So it'd be quite easy for them to then take one of the animals and walk it down the branch of the tree to see if they've identified it correct. You could do it with pictures of animals as well, but it's kind of fun to use these little finger puppets because they are quite sweet. Um, a quick word of advice, these are from Ikea. Um, so as normal, there's bits missing. So the octopus is only a uh, pentapus. There's only five there. Um, I think he might be a squid, but even so there's still bits missing. So there's always parts missing. You have to go back to the shop the next day to get the extra bits. So Ikea finger puppets for teaching classification. That's my top uh, science tip for the day. I'll have more tips in the future. If you like this video, please subscribe, click the bell to be notified when I add more videos. Um, I'll have some more science tips and some more tech tips in the near future. Thanks for listening.